I'm in desperate need of a physical glow up, which I haven't done in such a long time. My birthday is literally this month. I need to look cute. Also, I've been in a slump this past week because I was severely sick. So I've literally been stuck home. It's been pouring rain outside. I've been in this exact outfit that I haven't gotten out of. It just hasn't been the vibes. I just feel like in general, I haven't really been taking care of myself. So enjoy the vlog. Starting this glow up with a Pilates class. I've been doing Pilates every morning. If it's not at a studio, I'll do it at home. It is way harder than it seems, but it's become my favorite form of movement. I highly would recommend it if you guys want to build a strong core muscle, which definitely has been a goal of mine. workout that was so intense it literally killed me i'm dying i know for a fact i'm gonna be sore tomorrow but i also feel a lot better now i feel more awake i feel like i have more energy i'm like ready to take on the day i'm actually going to go get my nails done next i have a nail appointment to go and fix these because i actually hate my nails right now last time i went to go get them done i had asked for this and this was what i got i ended up just leaving them on and i'm finally gonna get rid of them so going and getting my nails done is always such an important step in my glow up routine because i love having nice nails and they make me feel super good and confident so whatever it is that makes you feel good and confident go and do that anyways now let's head over to the nail salon my nails that I got there for my birthday and I kind of just wanted subtle nails I wanted to get like the trendy glaze ones also these little rhinestones are so cute so in order to proceed with this glow up we need to do some self-care I currently have the shower running we're gonna take a really good shower then jump into some skincare I just feel so gross from today I have a bunch of new cute shower products that I got for Christmas that I'm excited to use here's like a mini haul that I want to take this self-care night a step further and I want to really deep clean my skin. I already showered, I washed my face, I smell good, I feel good, and I just want to feel more fresh and clean. I'm gonna put my hair up in this like pillow scrunchie. Then I have my cute skincare headband. So I have my facial steamer here that we're gonna be using. I'm gonna be wetting my face because I'm going to be going in with this facial skin scrubber and my face needs to be wet in order to use this. Okay, so next I am going to go in and shave my face. Need to wash my eyelashes and this is something that i always forget to do i think it's been like two days that i haven't washed my eyelashes i don't even have that many eyelashes left but i'm excited because i do have an eyelash appointment tomorrow to get these refilled The last thing I'm gonna put on is just a sheet face mask. These are from Burpees. I got a bunch of these for Christmas. Okay, I look kind of crazy. So I think I'm gonna leave this on probably for like 10 minutes. 
It's the next morning. I'm currently putting together a grocery list plus a few other things that I wanted to buy for this glow up. I'm also currently just ice rolling my face. I'm kind of mad that no one ever told me about ice rolling your face or that this was even a thing. I used to always just stick my face in ice cold water and doing this is just so much more convenient. I just love it because it wakes me up in the mornings. It has like actual benefits for glowing up your skin and apparently it also helps with like your eye bags which I just need. So 10 out of 10 would recommend it is pouring rain outside besides starting my healthy girl era we also need to get into my healthy hair era because guys my hair is dead especially the ends i need to go get this cut so i do have a haircut appointment i'm gonna get a hair treatment a blowout i do want to dye it a little darker but i'm gonna hold off on that for a little longer just because it is super dead right now i just want to leave my hair alone this is the before hair So this is the result of my hair. I felt so much more refreshed. It's still super dead, but I wasn't willing to cut more off or else it would be too short. But I love the way she styled my hair. I was kind of feeling myself. So I look like a mess again. I just woke up and we still have more glowing up to do. So today we're actually gonna be having like a spa day with the girlies. I'm actually pretty excited because I've never actually been to a spa like this. first time visiting this spa in LA. We did a float therapy, which is supposed to be really good for a mental recovery. I'll put all the benefits of this here on the screen. We basically just went into these pods and floated in salt water for around an hour. I just got back from the spa. It was super relaxing. I was just thinking that I feel like this week made me realize that I really should be prioritizing myself more often because doing that recently has felt so nice. As you guys know, last week I posted a video about how to create your dream life and I talked a lot about like mentally glowing up. And in this video, I'm basically mostly focusing on physically glowing up. And when I say physically glowing up, I don't mean like changing your appearance. I mostly mean like doing things that make you feel good, taking care of your body, doing it with things that are good for you. I'm actually gonna be taking this cute little like digestion shot this is gonna be so gross i'm not ready for it mm, i hated that but my body will thank me for this later i'm currently in my kitchen because i actually wanted to cook a new recipe tonight this new year one of my goals is to eat cleaner get on my health grind not eat out so much and actually just improve my cooking skills i wanted to try cooking the Gigi hadid pasta tonight because i've seen that all over tiktok and it looks so good <laughs> Remember that prioritizing your health is a super important part of glowing up. Nourish your body with good food. This is your sign to try out a new recipe this week. I felt so accomplished after cooking this. But anyways, next, to finalize this glow up. Next step, we need to put together a cute outfit. I did want to thank Red Up for sending me a few of their cute pieces to help me glow up my style and also for sponsoring today's video. So Thread Up is an online consignment and thrift store. And you guys know, I love shopping on Thread Up because it's a way easier way to thrift from home. I was able to find some of the best items on Thread Up using the site on mobile web and the thread up app thread up has the super cool new feature that makes it so that if you guys want to shop similar styles to what i thrifted you guys can actually go to this link here anyways now let me give you guys a quick thread up haul so first let's start off with a super cute pink little cardigan that i actually got from thread up and i've been wearing throughout this video this is the item i'm most obsessed with because i've been loving anything that has this like teddy bear material the brand of this cardigan is actually skims for some reason i always get super lucky when it comes to finding cute dresses on thread up this one here is actually from the brand urban outfitters it had an estimated retail price of 64 dollars 
and I got it on Threadup for only $25.99. And as for the outfit that I'm going to be wearing today, I have this cute little brown top here. One of my current trend predictions of 2023 is going to be more neutral basics like this. I'm so obsessed with the style of this. My favorite part about this top is the little ties that go around my waist. It's so flattering. The brand of this is actually from Juni. Then to go with it, I found this matching skirt. Also more on the trendy side, kind of gives off like a Pinterest schoolgirl type of look. The brand of this is Lucy. The estimated retail price of this is $57. And I got it on Threadup for only $22.99. Here are two of the outfits that I put together with the clothing that I got from Threadup. Remember, you guys can shop my picks with my link below and use my code Adela for an extra 35% off your first order. Covered this like hair wax stick that is apparently used by a lot of models like Gigi Hadid. Basically, you like pop this out and it just tamed all of your flyaways and baby hairs. This has become such an essential of my entire life. I've been looking for a product like this. I highly recommend this. If you guys are looking to glow up your hairstyles, definitely let me know if you want to see a makeup routine for me because I know I've never actually posted one on my channel. Some of my current favorite makeup essentials definitely consist of like Fenty beauty products which I'm actually super grateful for because they actually just sent me this other package, which I'm going to try out. But I do get a lot of questions about which foundation I use. And I'm not kidding you guys, I've been using this Fenty Pro Filter foundation for literal years now. I have tried different foundations, but I'm never gonna give up this one. But if I don't feel like wearing foundation, I also love wearing skin tints. And these are my two favorites. One of them is from Glossier. And then the other one, this is the Fenty Beauty Blurring Skin Tint. It actually has this like blurring effect on my skin, which is so cool. So this is the final glow up look so this is the final glow up look now i just wanted to take some cute pictures of my outfit and hair and makeup well, i hope you guys enjoyed today's video the day that you're watching this is actually my birthday and this year i am going to be making sure to be posting a birthday vlog which i've never done before so that's exciting make sure you're subscribed love you guys so much and bye